Moving on, beekeeping is a fascinating farming venture whose byproducts are not only honey but also other premium products such as propolis, bee venom, bee pollen, wax, as well as royal jelly, which is currently fetching 38,000 Kenya shillings per kilo. Our reporter Paul Thiongo talked to Chalo Mutua, the CEO of Savannah Honey, who says that more farmers are now venturing into the production of this untapped lucrative beekeeping product. For most of us, when we see bees, we automatically think of pollination or honey production. A few others will think of the pain associated with bee stings. Bees are also used as a symbol of hard work, diligence and cooperation. Having had a sit down with Chalomotua, also known as CEO Wanyuki, you immediately appreciate their importance and be surprised by the many products they produce and their uses. Pollen is the, is the male part of a flower. And when bees go to the, to the, to the forest uh, foraging, they will pick two things. They will drink nectar, which now mixes with enzymes in the stomach, now to make honey. And they also carry pollen by their legs, which now they would use in the hive. Of course, they, they do some secretion, mixed with some secretion, to make food for the young ones. Now, this pollen also has got uh, some very special protein that is not found in any meat. That's the interesting part about it. It's, it's a source of protein that uh, is not found in any legume. Now, royal jelly is the white, milkish honey in the hive. When you open a hive, even a traditional hive, you notice a place where there is a milkish honey. Honey that it looks like, more or less like milk. And this is uh, most of the time in a small quantity because it's food for one bee, that is the queen. This is what makes the queen stay for five years while the normal bee stays for 40 days. And if you have arthritis, if your arthritis about this joint, will direct the bees to bite you here to sting you here, that is in the morning, lunch, and evening, and for three days. Then we'll charge you 42,000 shillings. Savannah Honey provides farmers with all the necessary equipment, skills, and support to be able to harvest these premium products. Beekeeping can be a fulfilling and profitable venture in Kenya, not only providing a source of income, but also contributing to agricultural productivity and environmental conservation. Researchers and organizations in Kenya are continually working on innovation in beekeeping, such as hive designs and beekeeping techniques to improve honey production and bee health. Reporting for KTN News, I'm Paul Thiongo. Now, the judiciary has embarked on a multi-million project to power low courts with solar energy in the wake of increased power outages.